Hi, I'm Brad Jackson from Mountain Events. I'm the race director for the Herald Continental Cycle Tour Mountain Bike Race. I just want to take you through the routes and what you guys can expect out in Addo on Sunday the 17th of Feb. Uh, the routes have changed slightly from previous years, uh, the 60 kilometer and the 80 kilometer routes, and I'll go into the details of the changes shortly, but first a few general notes on um, how the racing will work. Uh, route marking, we always use um, our standard route marking, which is bright orange daglo stickers. You'll always find single stickers on the left hand side of the track as you're following the route. Uh, wherever you find two stickers, if they're on the left hand side, it indicates there's a turn to the left. If there's two stickers on the right, it indicates a turn to the right. Over and above the stickers that you're following, we have arrow signs at the major intersections. And very importantly, there's a number of places where the routes split, the various distances split in different directions. You need to pay attention to the signs at the splits. They're very clearly marked, but you need to follow your particular distance markers. So the first split is around about just after the first water point at about 10, 10 k's into the race, where the 60 and the 80 kilometer riders head up towards the Zeeburg Mountains. The 80 kilometer in the past has only gone halfway up the Zeeburg Pass, whereas this year they're continuing all the way up the pass as far as the Zeeburg Mountain Inn, uh, which is 33 kilometers into your race, and that is also the king of the mountain hotspot. From there, you pretty much turn and head downhill for the rest of the route. Uh, with a little bit of flats in between, but uh, there's a lot of single track from the turnaround point on, on the 80km route. The 60km route climbs part of the way up the pass and they turn left at the cutting, uh, halfway up, and they do the section which is known as the roller coaster for the first time. That's uh, the first time it's included in the 60k route. Uh, so they do an anti clockwise loop down the roller coaster and then rejoin with the 80km and the 30km route for the final 15km to the finish line. We've got plenty of water points out on the route at uh, spread out at, at various distances and uh, we encourage you to make use of the water points as it can get pretty hot out in Addo this time of the year. And uh, yeah, once again we just welcome you to enjoy the day at, at the Addo Polo Club where the locals have put on a fantastic market, um, there'll be plenty of activities for the kiddies and uh, yeah, some good food and a really good day out. So we look forward to seeing you on Sunday the 17th.